Hey everyone, it's March 5th, and I'm Garrett. And I'm Wyatt, and you're watching Wii TV. Here's the news. Jocelyn's is on campus today and tomorrow for cap and gown distribution during Astro Hour. You must pay your balance to pick up your graduation gear. Seniors who plan to graduate from EFSC with your AA this spring, the deadline for applying for graduation is Tuesday, March 8th. On Wednesday, March 7th, all juniors will be taking a free SAT exam that can be used for college entrance and or concordance scores for graduation. It is very important that students utilize this fraud free opportunity and try your personal best. You will need to bring a picture ID, pencils, and a calculator to, and a snack to the exam. Good luck. Congratulations to our wrestlers who placed in the state 1A wrestling tournament this past weekend at the Silver Spurs Arena. Carson Kirk placed My fifth man. and Lewis Cortez placed sixth. Way to go, War Eagles. Ron Norris Ford is hosting a fundraiser to support Project Graduation. We need drivers age 18 or over with a valid driver's license to stop by the school this Saturday, March 10th, anytime between 8 and 4 p.m. to test drive a new Ford and fill out a survey about it. This is not a car sales event. There will be um, Slayman's Barbecue and Snow Cones for sale, a 50-50 raffle, and a bounce house obstacle course. Let us know who your favorite senior is while you are here to help him or her earn door prizes and tickets for Project Graduation. Are you interested in being a cheerleader next year? There will be a parent meeting tomorrow, March 6th at 6.30 in the Media Center. If you are interested in trying out for Varsity or Sub Varsity Squad next year, you must attend the meeting with a parent or guardian. <coughs> Cheerleading tryouts for next year will be held on Friday, March 30th, beginning at 4.30 p.m. There will be three clinic days to learn the tryout material held on March 26th, 28th, and 29th from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m. Each of those days, each participant is required to attend at least two out of the three clinic days. You cannot attend the clinic days if you do not attend the parent meeting on next Tuesday. See Coach Ro Rocco if you have any questions. Live Love Paws sponsors the, the pet of the week this week. Adrienne O'Hara and Dots. Both pets are available at the Titusville SPCA. Remember, adopt, don't shop. The next and the last math perk test is next Thursday, March 15th. Miss Colette Zhao is doing a review each day during the first 10 to 15 minutes of Astro Hour. The review is held in room 502. Everyone is invited. Attention seniors. All seniors who wish to attend Project Graduation must register in advance. Registration will be held on Saturday, March 10th here at AHS. You should have received a yellow flyer explaining the process. If you have not received it, stop by the student services. The yearbook is currently $100 and there are less than 100 books left for sale. You can order online at www.jawsonsyearbooks.com or bring cash or check to room 131. Here is a video about our track meet from February 9th. Friday, February 9th kicked off astronauts track season. But I was pretty nervous at first. I feel like I did all right for, you know, my first meet. At this meet, there were a total of 13 schools competing in multiple events. It went really well. I uh, came in second in pole ball. It's going to be a decent season. During the meet, there was a power outage, but that did not stop them from competing. And the hurdles, the 55 meter hurdles and the 200 meter hurdles. So I ran the 55 meter hurdles and I came second in my heat, which is pretty fast. And then I came, I ran, I was supposed to run the 200 meter hurdles, but they canceled it, so I ran the 200 meter dash. Congrats to all those who place. Signing off from WeTV, this is Bree, Corinne, and Bria. Please keep your TVs to channel 2 so that you can see today's scrolling announcements. Thanks for watching and have a great day.